Hello, this is Lance Cleveland. I'm going to go a little bit deeper into our WebDriver IO automated website testing. Uh, if you missed it, on lance.bio there is another article setting up WebDriver IO for automated web testing. That goes over how to get WebDriver IO installed using Node, the Node Package Manager, to get all the components you need. Uh, one of the keys that we're going to highlight in this video is using Mocha. That adds the uh, syntax sugar, I like to call it. It also talks to the uh, spec runner uh, reporting, which gives us a little bit nicer of an output. So if you need uh, instructions, go to lance.bio. You can find this article there that will show you uh, how to set up the test. So here I have my test. It's already configured um, from the previous setup to run and open up the Chrome browser and open up my test site. So I'll run that test so you can see how it looks. Let it fire up Chrome. There's the Chrome browser. It's going to go open up the site and it's done. No output. Not very friendly. So we want to know the test ran. So we're going to use um, the Mocha uh, language and we're going to add some elements here. So the two primary components to Mocha is the describe and the it clauses that are going to help us uh, show us what's going on. In this case, we're going to describe what the group of tests is that we're running. This is the plain text here of what we want to output in our report that we're testing the website login. It goes inside of a standard JavaScript function here. So that's that describe statement. And then inside of it, you run multiple tests. In this case, this is what the test is going to do. This particular test is just going to show the login page, pretty simplistic, and then open the uh, URL, the uh, slash. It's actually, if you missed it from the last video, is reading from the config file that is what WebDriver is going to use, and it is actually going to go in and uh, open up the site that's defined in here, which is a test um, file that we've got set up. So now let's rerun that test, same test, with the Mocha, and the spec reporter is going to show us some more detailed outputs. So it's going to run it, open up the site, close it, done. And you can see here's your output. It's telling you that the session ID, the test that was run, what it was run in, in this case Chrome, and then there's our describe statement, and there's the test. And it shows the test passed. We didn't throw any errors. So we'll get into that uh, in the next result. I want to just do a quick short video of how these tests look and how they run. This is a terminal window that I'm running this from command line, and it's showing me what happened with the automated test. That's it for the quick overview of more detailed reports from Mocha. As always, thank you for watching.